hello friends and welcome to youtube channel freedom tech and in this session what we are going to learn in this session we are going to see how we can detect the both hands same time on raspbian buster okay so we are going to install cp zone on raspberry pi 4 raspbian buster 32 bit version the legacy version okay so before we move to our practical friends if you learn something from our videos please consider to subscribe our channel okay friends thank you so much and let's get started so friends as i told you we are going to install the cv zone means how to install the cv zone on raspberry pi 4 raspbian buster legacy 32 bit version and then after with the help of cv zone we can detect our both hands at same time okay for that first we need to install the latest open cv tensorflow light and media pipe on raspberry pi 4 raspbian buster legacy version i have already created the video how to install three modules which is the open cv tensorflow light and media pipe on the buster legacy version i will mention the video link watch video and just install three modules okay so i have already installed the basic module which is the open cv tensorflow light and media pipe then as i told you first we need to install the cv zone on raspberry pi 4 buster legacy version so for that we need to simply run the command so do pip3 install cv zone and just hit enter it will install the cv zone on our raspberry pi 4 buster legacy version which i have already installed as you can see the requirement is already satisfied that's it then we need to simply open our Tony editor, create the new file, mention the name. I mentioned here the name hand.py. You can mention any name. Okay. Then this is what our basic code for starting or for capturing the video frame with the help of web camera on Raspberry Pi 4 Buster Legacy. Okay. So as you can see, this is what our basic code. If I start the code, as you can see, the frame is started our web camera is started and this is what our live frame okay so now we successfully install our cv zone so we need to import our cv zone module so from from cv zone from cv zone dot hand tracking module like this way h capital t capital and m capital cv zone dot hand tracking module import hand detector again h capital and the d capital okay so from cv zone dot hand tracking module import hand detector this is how we need to call our module then detector is just a variable and we need to use our hand detector okay so copy it and just paste over here and inside that we need to pass the maximum hands and detection confidence level so detection con is equal to let us say 0 0.5 and the max hands is equal to 2 ok because we need to detect our both hands the left one and the right one so detection con is equal to 0 0.5 and max h capital here also c capital is equal to 2 ok so we have successfully import the module we successfully call our module with the variable so let's just test it so if i start the code as you can see there is no error means we have successfully call our module so now we want to use our detector variable after cv2 flip means after where we flip our frame so here we need to mention hands 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 and the frame okay hands frame is equal to we need to call our detector variable detector so detector dot find hands inside that detector we need to find our hands so detector find h capital find hands and inside that we need to pass our frame that is it so if i save the code and if i run the code the frame is started and if i show the hands as you can see this one is the left and this one is the right so it means we have successfully detect the both hands same time the left one and the right one okay so we successfully detect our hands now what we want to do we want to check 
what basically we have inside the hands okay so if we try to print the hands okay oh what the mistake hands like this way save the code if i run the code the camera is started right now there is nothing so we want to show the hands and as you can see we have lots of information so let me stop the code and if we move up here it is if you see clear we have the lm list means the points then we have type which hands we have the left one then the center points and we have the b box also bounding box okay so with the help of b box coordinates we can basically uh, we can basically measure the distance in between camera and our hands so all these things how to measure the distance between hands and the camera we will see in our next video but today we are going to only see how basically we can use a cv zone for detecting multiple hands or we can say the both hands the left one and the right one at same time okay so i hope you all clear now we have the information inside the hands now how we can uh, how we can detect the how many fingers right now up so for that simply we need to mention if hands if hands is there then we can say hands 1 let's call hands 1 hands 1 is equal to hands and inside that we need to pass the index number 0 okay so index number 0 then fingers 1 okay fingers 1 is equal to again we need to mention our detector variable so detector dot fingers u capital up and inside that we need to pass hands 1 okay so if i print fingers 1 save the code and run the code frame is started okay so i want to show the frame and as you can see the left hands detected and here it is as you can see we have 1 2 3 4 5 5 five fingers up now 0 1 2 3 4 4 4 four finger up now 3 fingers up now 2 fingers up as you can see the 2 fingers up now only 1 fingers up okay so this is how you can detect how many fingers now up so this is for only one hands how to detect the both hands simple we can say here if the length length of hands length of hands is equal to 2 okay so if the length of hands is equal to 2 then we can simply let's first try to print both hands okay so save the code if i run the code okay so now only we want to stop to print the fingers one okay so if i start right now it start the code and right now there is only one hands the left one if i show the both hands as you can see it's printed the both hands let just say like this way if there is the both hands then it will print both hands else then we will get the idea okay else print one hands one hands okay so save the code and the code
one hand now as you can see the both hands okay again one hands the both hands so it means it successfully detect the both hands oh okay so now what we want to do we don't want to print all these things this is for our idea now if the both hands is there same code we are going to call here so just copy and paste and this time only we want to change hands one with hands two and this hands the index number now will be one and here also we will to change the fingers one with fingers two and fingers up will become hands two and then we can print the both fingers the finger one and finger two okay so if i save the code and if we run the code as you can see the camera is started and as you can see here now it's printed the 10 fingers okay so as you can see the 0 0 1 now only two fingers are up okay one from the left one from the right okay so if i go like this way as you can see left two fingers up and right also two fingers up so this is how friends you can you can use a cv zone also on the raspberry pi 4 for detecting the both hands okay i hope you would learn something from this video we will meet our next video till then thank you take care and bye bye